Hello dudes, dudettes, and all those in between. It is a crazy gun nut here again. And I know I just did a video on the new cars in GTA, but they released a new car today, so we get to review that one as well. Um, so yeah, this is my first foray into live recording my commentary. Um, so if I sound a bit dumb sometimes or I mispronounce a word, uh, just go ahead and roast me in the comments. I totally understand. So let's get into it. So the first thing we got to do is definitely got to spin that wheel so we can uh, we can see if we can win that ardent there. All right, baby, let's go. Give me the ardent. Come on, come on. Nah. Clothing. All right, what I get? A a slalom motocross. That's not what I wanted, but all right. So that's the car you can potentially win. Um, so go spin the wheel. Maybe you'll be luckier than I will. Alrighty, so the new vehicle is the Garotti Furia. Looks like it's a mixture of some uh, some McLarens and some Ferraris. So clearly we have to order it in red. Put that in our arcade garage. We got our off-road buggy here. I reviewed this in the previous video uh, based on the aerial. Uh, don't know what the model name is, but it's an aerial. I can tell you that. Um, I upgraded mine a little bit. It's a little bit faster. Got different wheels on it and different exhausts and stuff like that. But all in all, it's mostly the same as it was when it came from Legendary. No, I'm sorry. It's a San Andreas Super Autos uh, vehicle. So definitely pick that up and ignore the fact that I just completely busted it up against a tree. And here we are. So let's get this baby out and try it. All right, here she is. The Grotti Furiosa, Furo, Furia, 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 right? Yeah, Grotti Furia. So it's definitely uh, heavily inspired by some of the newer Ferraris, uh, your 458s, your, um, what is the other one called? Regardless, it's 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 modeled after some new Ferraris. So, let's see how it handles and modify it a little bit. Sound good? Okay, so it's got an active spoiler. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> Definitely handles pretty well. It's a you're pretty mid tier supercar. It's not ridiculously fast, but it is definitely supercar fast for GTA. Um, it's pretty enjoyable to drive so far, but hopefully we can get some cool stuff done to it. That'd be pretty. Pretty interesting. All right, let's take it into LS Customs and uh, see how much we can really mess it up. Or maybe make it better. We'll find out. <clears throat> All right, so we've got armor, which is pretty normal. Go ahead and make that max. Brakes, max. Bumpers, all right. So we've got the Custom Splitter. Primary Custom Splitter, Secondary Custom Splitter, Street Splitter, Carbon Street Splitter, Super Splitter, Primary Super Splitter, Secondary Super Splitter, and that is it. So, let's see here. I think... I think I'm going to go with the Carbon Street Splitter on this one. Let's see what we got in the rear here. Yeah, some different diffuser... Diffu okay, it's the first one. Make fun of me in the comments. Diffusers, got the focus diffuser, primary focus diffuser, secondary focus diffuser, GT diffuser, carbon GT diffuser. Um, I think I'm gonna go with the carbon GT diffuser. That looks pretty sweet. Canards, um, I'm really not a fan of canards. Definitely depends on the car. Um, this one, I'm gonna have to go with no canards on it. Engine block, oh, okay. That's cool, you can change the accents on the engine block to match the primary color. Uh, engine tunes, upgraded all the way. Exhaust. We've got titanium tipped exhausts. Aluminum tipped exhausts. Split oval exhausts. Infinity exhaust. Carbon infinity exhaust. Primary jet exhausts. Oh, that's cool. Comes out of the top. Secondary jet exhaust, same thing, just in the, the secondary color. 
flushed exhaust, carbon flushed exhaust, titanium flushed exhaust, mounted exhaust, carbon mounted exhaust, titanium, exposed. I think I'm gonna have to go with the exposed. That's pretty cool coming out of the top of the car. Yeah, that's really cool. <clears throat> yeah, I don't want to put any explosives on it. So let's see here. Got all kinds of different hoods there. Carbon inlet, instep, rally duct, carbon rally duct, hood vents. Um, let's go. I kind of like the offset look with stuff like that. So let's go with the rally duct. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. What else we got here? Horns. I don't usually mess with the horns. Uh, xenon lights. Xeon, whatever. Liveries. Here we go. Black stripes. White stripes. Tricolor. That's very 458. Dark two-tone. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Pissvasa. Pretty neat. It's kind of like a race car. Globe oil race car. Douche rally. Stronzo racer. Fukaru warrior. That's really cool. I like that. Masterpiece. That's neat. Kind of like an art installation car. Um, I think I'm actually going to go with the masterpiece. That looks pretty sweet. Let's look here. Uh, just different colored mirrors. We'll stick with them with the primary color. Uh, put my patented skirt plate on there. Uh -huh. Let's see. Primary color. Let's see what looks good with this design. Oh, that white looks pretty good. Yeah. I actually really like that. Let's go with ice white on that. And secondary. I don't think I made anything in here secondary, so... Yeah, there's nothing that's really going to change. Okay, trim color. Let's give it a nice red. Yeah. And unfortunately, it doesn't look like you can change the color of the roof. Looks like it might be carbon fiber. Just matte black. It's kind of annoying. Oh, no, here it is. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Primary roof. Well, that's not my primary color, but... That's weird. Might be a glitch, but... Let's do the carbon roof just so we have an excuse for it to be uh, to be black. Skirts. Oh, what do we got here? Let's go with the red accented grotty skirt. That looks pretty cool. Suspension. Slam it. Transmission. Transmission all the way up. Turbski. Definitely going to put that on there. Wheels. Um, let's go see what some sport wheels look like. Those are pretty cool. Let's go with those ground rides. Wheel color. <coughs> I usually go with black. Um, I think that's pretty much gonna look the best with this car as well. So we'll go with that. What else we got? Windows. Probably the last option we got here for this car. Yep. All right, so there is the finished, at least my finished build of the Furiosa, or Fu Furia, Furia. I don't know why, I, I want to think of like Empress of Furiosa from uh, from Mad Max. I keep calling it the Furiosa. It's the Furia, Fur Furia, something along those lines. Um, it is definitely a great looking car, especially when you get deliveries on it and upgrade it a little bit. It's fast, very fast once you get it upgraded. Very cool car. Very fun car to drive. I will definitely be keeping this one in my collection. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Alright guys, well, that about wraps it up. If you stuck around this long, please give it a like. If you hated it, give me a dislike. Drop in the comments below what you want to see next, if there's anything that's on your mind or something you want to hear me review. If you haven't checked out Fuel Gaming, definitely go over there and give us a follow at FuelGamingGG on Twitter. If you haven't given me a follow, CrazyGunNutYT on Twitter, definitely check us out. Give us a follow. Keep up to date on all your gaming news. And uh, holler at your boy, CrazyGunNut, out.